Hi everyone, my name is Danny Grondin and again I want to share with you a little RV tip that I like. We all know that the inside of our RV become pretty hot pretty fast during the summertime. Even a short stop to grab something to eat turn out to be sticky pretty fast. Using the AC is not often an option because of the location the accessible power or just the annoying noise coming out of our old technology inexpensive heat pump. Many years ago I met a nice guy in Winkler, Manitoba and he told me that he used to travel the world in a 30 something foot boat. He also told me that all boats have extensive 12 volt fan inside to help cope with the same heat issue. He made me buy a fan made for the boating industry, a 12 volt low noise low power draw made by a company named Illumarine out of Germany. I bought the fan and this fan has been extensively used in my coach during the day as well as during the night. A few months ago I happened to lose a screw of that fan and I tried to reach the manufacturer to get a spare part but I didn't get any success. Over that, we want to add a second fan for my wife. Reading some comments on the new ILA fan, I found that the rating have decreased since my initial purchase years ago. And the fact that the product is now made in China instead of Germany made me want to look elsewhere. I went on a quest to find a very reliable replacement and believe me, it was a real quest as the web is full of cheap imported fans. The features I was looking for was a very good quality marine grade hardware with a small footprint. Reliability is always very important. Very low electrical draw, very low noise as we use it almost every day and every night. Either when it's very hot outside and even more when it's cold while the furnace is running. 12 volts too, because the inverters draw power just being on. Sometimes more than 10% is lost in inefficiency. To my great surprise, I found all of those features in a fan made by a Canadian company called Caframo. You heard me, it's a Canadian company. The model is Bora, it's from their Sicar division. I ordered one and tested it for the best part of the spring and for my last vacation. This one filled the bill perfectly. It's very quiet, have better material, sturdier, beefier than the Ella. And there is no danger to get my fingers cut up by the spinning blades at the rear of the fan. Because the Bora's back is covered just like the front. There's three speed instead of two, two years of warranty and the company state that the motor should last 5,000 hours. I install my fan on a little piece of plywood to make it portable. Sometime to have the breeze in my face, other time to mix up the air in the coach to get a more even distribution of the air from the AC and other time to mix up the air coming from the furnace. This make the coach immensely more comfortable. Here I'm testing the power draw from both fan using the Victron Connect software on my iPad and the new Bora was as good or better but depending on the speed and more convenient since you have one more speed to choose from. Same deal here testing the noise pressure with an app on my iPad. The Bora was as good or a little bit better depending on the speed. I just cannot miss a chance to brag about my rear window. It's a bummer that LTV decided to kill them on Murphy bed models. Uh, the Bora fan naturally can be installed permanently at most anywhere with uh, the bracket that comes with the fan. But I prefer to have a portable version to accommodate uh, whatever situation I might be in. Real world application 
if we have to heat the coach with the furnace, uh, we'll put the fan in the uh, bedroom and orient it, those fins at the floor to mix up the air. I'm super happy to have found this company. Just like our LTV, it's proudly made in Canada and I recommend this product to anyone tired to get dripping sweat in the face. Thank you again folks and always I'm sorry for my English, I try my best. I know it's a little bit boring to listen to someone do read a text but uh, since I'm not that good in English I try my best and I really thank you all for being part of the Leisure Travel Van Enthusiast group. Safe travels everyone!